Picture this, a creature lurks in the darkest corners of our planet, a creature so strange it could very well be from another world. This is the tale of the giant squid, a being as enigmatic as it is colossal, dwelling in the deepest trenches of our oceans. Giant squids, while a part of our earthly biosphere are shrouded in mystery. Their elusive nature has made them subjects of fascination and fear, with their existence only confirmed in the late 19th century. Even today, our knowledge of them is limited. These behemoths can grow up to 43 feet long, a size that's hard to fathom, akin to a school bus. Their bodies are adorned with two enormous tentacles, eight arms, and the largest eyes in the animal kingdom, the size of dinner plates. These eyes, peering out from the abyss, are designed to capture the faintest glimmers of light in their pitch-black habitat. But it's not their size alone that's baffling. Giant squids possess the ability to change color, a trick achieved by special cells in their skin called chromatophores. These cells can expand and contract allowing the squid to display a captivating array of colors and patterns. Imagine a creature that can camouflage itself in an instant or flash warning signals across its body. Even more intriguing is their complex nervous system. Giant squids possess a large brain and an intricate network of nerves. They exhibit signs of intelligence and have even been known to engage in battles with their nemesis, the sperm whale. Now, you may wonder, what makes these creatures so alien-like? Their sheer size? Their ability to change colors? Their complex nervous system? Or perhaps it's their elusive nature, their habitat in the least explored parts of our planet, that fuels this speculation. Could these sea monsters be aliens hiding in plain sight? Unearth the evidence with us. Stay tuned as we delve deeper into the enigma of the deep, exploring the alien traits and cosmic connections that make the giant squid a creature of extraterrestrial fascination. Did you know that giant squids share some uncanny similarities with creatures we've imagined on other planets? Let's dive into the unique traits of these denizens of the deep that make them seem, well, a little alien. First off, let's talk bioluminescence. In the black abyss of the deep sea, light doesn't reach far, Yet many inhabitants of this world including the giant squid, have evolved an eerie solution, they create their own light. Bioluminescence is a trait we often associate with alien life forms in popular culture. From the glowing creatures of Pandora in the movie Avatar, to the extraterrestrial organisms in science fiction novels, bioluminescence is a common trope for otherworldly beings, but the similarities don't stop there. Giant squids also have a remarkable ability to survive under extreme conditions. The crushing pressure, freezing temperatures and complete darkness of the deep sea would be lethal to most life forms. Yet these cephalopods thrive in such hostile environments. Sounds familiar? In our collective imagination, alien beings often dwell in harsh, uninhabitable worlds, much like the uninviting depths of our oceans. Lastly, let's not forget the brain of the giant squid which is highly developed. Despite their alien-like physical attributes, these creatures exhibit complex behaviors and learning abilities. Their donut-shaped brains are the largest of any invertebrate and they're known for their problem-solving skills and memory retention. These are traits we often attribute to intelligent life forms, terrestrial or otherwise. So, what does this all mean? Are we looking at a creature of our own planet, or an alien being hiding in plain sight? Bioluminescence, resilience in extreme conditions, and advanced cognitive abilities, these are all traits we've long associated with extraterrestrial life. Yet they are all found in the giant squid, a creature of our own ocean's depths. Could these traits be mere coincidence or are they signs of an extraterrestrial origin? Stay tuned as we delve deeper into this fascinating topic in our next scene, The Cosmic Connection. What if the giant squid's origin story is written not in the depths of our oceans but in the stars above? Now that's an idea to wrap your tentacles around, isn't it? Let's delve into the concept of panspermia. In a nutshell it's the hypothesis that life exists throughout the universe and is distributed by space dust, meteoroids, asteroids, comets, planetoids, and also by spacecraft in the form of unintended contamination by microorganisms. So, could our cephalopod friend the giant squid be a cosmic immigrant? The conditions in the deep sea where these squids reside are incredibly harsh. It's a world of crushing pressures, frigid temperatures and eternal darkness save for the occasional bioluminescent glow, sounds a bit like outer space doesn't it? And it's not just the overall conditions that are eerily similar. The specific adaptations of the giant squid also hint at a possible extraterrestrial origin. Consider this, 
Some of our solar system's celestial bodies like Jupiter's moon Europa and Saturn's moon Enceladus are believed to harbor vast oceans beneath their icy surfaces. These oceans could provide similar conditions to our own deep seas. Could it be possible that life similar to our giant squids could exist there? Or even more tantalizing, could life have traveled between these cosmic bodies? In the vast expanse of the cosmos, the possibility of life being transferred from one celestial body to another isn't entirely outlandish. After all, we've found microbes on Earth that can survive the harsh conditions of space, and we've discovered amino acids, the building blocks of life on meteorites. So, it's not a giant leap to theorize that more complex organisms like the giant squid could have originated elsewhere and found a home in the depths of our oceans. So, as we gaze upon these majestic creatures of the deep, we must ask ourselves, could the giant squid be a relic of an ancient cosmic journey? The answer may be floating among the stars, waiting to be discovered. In the giant squid's DNA, we find further clues that suggest an otherworldly origin. The blueprint of life as we know it, DNA, is composed of four simple letters, A, T, G, and C. Yet, within the giant squid, we discover a fifth letter, one that is not present in any other species on Earth, a letter that perhaps spells out a message from across the cosmos. The giant squid's DNA is a marvel in itself, boasting an astonishingly large genome. To put it into perspective, humans have a genome of approximately 3 billion base pairs. The giant squid, over 10 billion base pairs. That's over three times the size of our own genetic code. It's as if nature, or perhaps an entity beyond our understanding, decided to grant these creatures an extra dose of genetic material. But it's not just the size of the genome that's intriguing, it's the content. Within this vast genetic landscape there are genes that we cannot find anywhere else on Earth. Genes that code for proteins and processes that are alien to our understanding of biology. These are not subtle variations of known genes but entirely new sequences, as if they were written in a language that we are yet to decipher. Could these genetic anomalies suggest an extraterrestrial origin? This is not as far-fetched as it might sound. Panspermia, the theory that life on Earth could have originated from outer space, is a topic of serious discussion among scientists. Could the giant squid be evidence of such a cosmic connection? In their DNA, are we reading an alien blueprint? Are the giant squids a remnant of a cosmic seeding event, their DNA carrying a message from a distant star? Or is their genetic code simply the result of Earth's own unique evolutionary journey, a testament to the diversity and adaptability of life on our planet? These are questions that continue to puzzle and fascinate us as we delve deeper into the enigma of the giant squid, the alien of the deep. So, are giant squids really aliens hiding in our oceans? Let's take a moment to revisit the points we've discussed thus far. We began our journey by diving into the depths of the ocean, where we encountered the enigmatic giant squid. A creature so uniquely designed and bizarrely different from anything we're familiar with, it's hard not to question its earthly origins. Its massive size, eight arms studded with suction cups, and two longer tentacles make it an unusual inhabitant of our planet's waters. Then, we explored the concept of panspermia, the theory suggesting that life, or the building blocks of life, could have originated from outer space and been transported to Earth. The idea is not so far-fetched when you consider the countless asteroids, comets, and meteorites traversing the vast expanse of the cosmos, potentially carrying microbial life or organic compounds. Could the giant squid be a result of such a cosmic delivery? Next, we delved into the realm of genetics and discovered peculiar anomalies in squid DNA. Unlike other creatures, the giant squid's genetic makeup has shown to possess an extraordinary amount of variation. This kind of genetic diversity is unusual and could hint at an extraterrestrial origin. Each of these points, when viewed separately, may not conclusively prove that giant squids are aliens. But when pieced together, they paint a compelling picture that's hard to ignore. Could these deep-sea dwellers be living proof of extraterrestrial life? Or are they simply a testament to the diverse and extraordinary life forms our planet is capable of producing? The truth remains elusive. But one thing's for sure, the giant squid continues to challenge our understanding of life on Earth, and perhaps beyond.